All right, every night here on Fox 9 on your side, we take a closer look at the weather and we get some help from some uh, whiz kids tonight. That's right, we have been, been asking the kids, oh, the kids have been asking all kinds of questions. We've said, would you like to ask a question about the weather? And all these hands go up suddenly, <laughs> right? So we've got lots of great questions. I went to Hunter Elementary last week and uh, Bridge Tower Subdivision of Meridian, and here's the, one of the questions that we got. Your name is? Grace, I'm from Hunter Elementary and how, how can the earth spin and you can't feel it? What she said, thank you so much, Grace. What she says is, how come if the earth is spinning, we can't feel it? Why is that the case? Well, it's a great question. A lot of people have asked that question, so we're going to try to answer that for you if I can get to the right graphic here. Well, let's just use this one right here again. Here's the Earth, and it's spinning right now. Why don't we feel it? Do you know how fast the Earth is spinning? First of all, at the equator, it's spinning just over a thousand miles per hour. If you're at the equator, that's how fast the Earth is spinning. If you're at the North Pole, the effective speed is zero because it's just kind of circulating around one point. And if you get to our latitude, about 45 degrees north, we're going about 725 miles per hour right Right now, if you can hear my voice, that's about how fast we're traveling, but we don't feel it. It's much like being in an airplane. You're traveling at 500 miles an hour when things are going steady and there's no acceleration or deceleration, you really don't even notice it, provided it's not too bumpy there. But if there's a, a quick change in the speed, you would certainly notice it. And that's the same thing with the Earth. If we sped the Earth up and made it go more quickly, or if it slowed down, we would certainly feel it. It would be more like we'd have to balance ourselves by leaning into it or leaning away from it. But the, the general rule is that we're not going to feel it. Now, if the Earth spun so fast, instead of taking 24 hours to go around, if it got around in an hour, in 20 minutes, we'd be spinning so fast that we would fly off the Earth. It would overcome gravity, which is holding us to the Earth right now. And so, uh, basically, we don't want the Earth to speed up that much. So we'll keep it going right about 725 miles an hour where we are. Roll it. And if it went slower, would gravity increase? We you know, start scrunching. It, it, it actually would increase. That's a great point really? because it's centripetal force in one direction yeah. and gravity in the other direction. So, you know, if we slow it down, I wonder how much more we would weigh. Now, let's not talk about that. No, we don't. let's avoid that issue. <laughs> Thanks, Scott. Well, another day.